Vaughn going deep with Mo joins us each week as he does. Uh, Mo, how did you finish fourth in that poll? I would, I would, yeah, you know, I didn't see it, or we all would have voted more for you, obviously. I think, I think I'm the old guy. You know what I mean? <laughs> and these younger, younger fans haven't seen me play, but they listen. You know, these guys. You got David, who's awesome. Manny was awesome. You know how I feel about Rafael, but actually. I wasn't really a good bat and practice hitter. Um, I needed actually the velocity of the ball to drive the ball. I wasn't able to like just club the ball out of ballpark and bat and practice. So maybe these guys are right, but I always figured forget the derby. It matters what we do in the game. Now, that's, it's a great point because home run derbies, and we should say you both took part in home run derbies. You were in the first one. 1985, 10 years later, Mo, you were in the second one in 1995. They're different. No, no. Ask me, do I remember? <laughs> no. You don't remember, you don't remember the home run derby at the Metrodome? I don't remember. You don't remember it at all? No, I, I, all I, 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 I don't. All-star. You don't remember the home run? I, I, See, this is unbelievable. I, I swear I don't. I, Mo, you remember your home run derby? Yeah, it was, it was horrible. <laughs> First of all, I never really, you know, you're standing out there. It's you, the, the, bat, the BP coach, he's trying to throw you a strike. You, you know, Usually you're taking bad press. You know, Jimmy, with the turtle on top of you. You know what I mean? Now you're in the clear wide open with, with a packed house trying to drive this baseball apart. I was, I, I, it was very uncomfortable for me. I, um, you know, uh, I was like, man, this, is, this seems like a lot of pressure. But I told you, I, I, I just never really, you know, was a, was a BP guy. So it was, it was tough for me to, to, to get to get going and get started in those home run derbies. When Marvin's talk about BP, sometimes when a player's going good, he doesn't want to take BP. I didn't take BP. I took uh, batting practice under, underneath, uh, I, I, I was in the field with Johnny Pesky. Because you get there and a lot of times the opposing team comes on the field and you want to show off, you want to hit the ball hard, and you go out of your swing. So a lot of times, you're talking about June and July, if you haven't learned how to hit by July, Mo, you know you're not going to hit. <laughs> you leave BP alone. It's to be tough. Yeah. You're right, you gotta, you gotta know yourself. You know, I loved it. Um, being left-handed, especially taking bat and practice at Fenway Park, I just started to get that feel of the, of the of the of the of the monster going the other way, driving the ball. And then you also know that in Fenway Park for a left-handed hitter, it's 380. It's not like you know, it's right there sitting for you at like the like the Portuguese Yankee Stadium. It's 380, so you got to be perfect. So I really never wanted to really get out there and start turning the ball in, in Fenway Park because. It, 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 it could get you into some bad habits. All right, so again, to refresh your memory, Jim, you took place in 1985 in the Metrodome. Frank Thomas won it. Okay. He finished tied for third. Uh, and, and, and I believe, no, Frank Thomas won yours. I'm mixing them up. You I won. apologize. Dave Parker won yours. Dave Parker won yours. Frank Thomas won in 95 with you, Mo. And I, I want to ask you both that because you talk about what happens in batting practice, but we've heard guys say the home run derby messed me up for a month. Mm -hmm. David Ortiz uh, didn't want to do it anymore because all of a sudden you come completely out of your swing trying to do things that don't come natural. You guys were both line drive hitters. You guys both tried to hit to the gap. You weren't necessarily home run hitters. Did you find that that home run derby, Mo, messed you up in any way or changed uh, the way you were approaching things at the plate? I think the mindset could. Like I said, I wasn't very good at it, so I was happy to get back to taking regular BP and, and, you know, and just, you know, slicing the ball and getting through the ball and staying inside the ball. But I could see, I've, I've heard some stories and, you know, I've seen in the past where guys have gone out and really gone crazy in the home run derby and won, and won it and then got back to the field, you know, during, you know, they went, once the season's kicked back up and they couldn't find it. So, um, yeah, it, it could be an issue. It was a different format, Jim, when you did. It was the very first one, and it was uh, you hit four home runs, Dave Parker won it with six. So, so you were right there. But I can't imagine you would have changed anything. You know what I mean? I, that just doesn't seem like you. You were going to go up there and do what you do because you approach yeah. the game and approach your at-bats a certain way. And the thing about it, I didn't really have to try to launch the ball. I was trying to hit line drive, so I really didn't change anything. But now what you have, you have – Guys bring their own BP guys now. We didn't have that. So no. if we played in, in the Metrodome, the Metrodome BP guy was going to throw. Uh, the game has changed. The players are still the same. But uh, 
they just might can do what they want to now. Yeah, there, was no, there was no golden ball with a no. home being given away, a house being given away. I, I do want to ask you both real quick. It's interesting that they brought that whole uh, poll up that night because Devers was on it, right? It was about Devers. That was really the point. And you don't really think of him as a home run guy. But he's got 14 home runs. I mean, this guy's shown tremendous power for a very young player. Are you surprised by the power he's showing, Mo? Not at all. He's, he's aggressive. He stays through the ball. Um, he can hit the ball out of anywhere in the ballpark. Um, lots of home runs in center field, left field. So he's on it. I mean, listen, he's he's not a a a he's not a, like you know my size or anything. But he's got you know good height, good strength. He's He's long and lean. He's a great athlete. He can run. He does a lot of good things. He's, he's athletic and strong. So, yes, he can, he can be that productive, no doubt. He's not a home run hitter, but he can hit home runs. And what I mean by that, I like when he hit the ball to the left field. So when you got that, he's not a home run hitter. He's just a line drive slasher like Vladimir, and I love every, I love the kid. The kid is something else. The kid, as yeah. he calls him, leads Major League Baseball and extra base hits this year the most since the beginning of 2019. But, Jim, you get the last word. Okay. Home run derby. Rafael Devers in his prime. Mo Vaughn in his prime. Who's winning the derby? Maurice. See. See. We give him the last word on that one, Mo. I won't even ask you. Appreciate I think, it, Jimmy. Like That's I said, true. like you said at the beginning, I think that it's the re- recency bias, we call it. Yeah, but People you should think about the most recent guy. You should have asked the real question. Maurice or me? Well, that was the real, the real question is why was Jim Rice not in that poll? No doubt. I mean, that's the real question, but that's a question for another day. But see, uh, my, Maurice will be trying to hit the ball to the right field. I'll be hitting the ball to the right field, too. So we, what are we going to do? This is what we're going to do. Now, I was a pretty good right field hitter. So we will have a home run derby. Maurice can't pull the ball. He's got to hit the ball to the short fence and let me hit it to the big ball. They only count if you go up. Well, that's right. That would be a like good that. one. That would yeah. be a good one. That would be a good one. Opposite field home run derby. Mo, we appreciate it as always. Uh, take care. All right, have a good week, guys. Hi, Maurice. You too. Mo-